So we are starting the vlog off looking a mess. <laughs> just got back from getting my hair braided for my wig. Just needed some wig braids. This girl that I went to high school with, she did them for me. So shout out to her. Thank you, girl. Because y'all, I hate, 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 hate braiding my own hair. But yeah, let me just get y'all a sneak peek. My forehead is a five head. Some regular wig braids straight to the back. Nothing fancy. So if you are new, I'm sorry y'all. My name is Corinne. And if you are an OG here on my channel, then you already know. You already know. What's up? I'm actually about to go. This is the start of a vlog. Today is the 17th of February. A what's today? Thursday. Right now I got a few things to do, not much. To go to the dry cleaners to pick up this dress. And then when I get back, I have to install a wig. This is the wig right here that I will be reviewing in this vlog for y'all today. Once I install that wig, I gotta clean my room. Um, just a little update on what's going on. I'm going on a vacation on Monday. So this is like the prep, getting ready, cleaning up, packing, all that good stuff. But y'all already know the girls who watch my channel that I work on the weekends. So I will not be vlogging much. Let me go and head to this dry cleaners because my car has started. I need to throw a wig on because I don't want to go like that. <laughs> Looking like a little boy. Yeah, I will see y'all once I make it to the dry cleaners. Okay, so I just threw on this bob wig. Just so I can go outside. To pick up this dress. So... Let's go. I still look a mess. <laughs> so cold out here, y'all. Oh my God. And my big coat is in my closet. But I'm just trying to hurry up and um, go and get this dress out the cleaners. Um, I'm supposed to be getting a few inches of snow. So let me hurry up and do what I need to do before it start getting crazy out here. No matter what keep doing with you. Okay, um, let me cut this music off. Okay, so this is the cleaners that I'm at. And I'm here to pick up a dress that I'll be wearing to a wedding. So this is it. This is it. I'm running. I'm not going to bring my camera in. My little braid hanging out the wig. <laughs> oh my God. I'm just out here so bogus. I got the dress. Can y'all see? Well, y'all can't see. It's in the bag back there. I am about to go to Dunkin' Donuts. My mama said, can you give me an iced coffee? So I'm finna go get her an iced coffee. And then I'm going in the house so I can review the Love Me wig for y'all. And yeah, today is a good day. Although it just started snowing. Y'all see, the police is trying to get this man to get the f <laughs> to get on but he just out here so um yeah anyways i will see y'all once i get to dunkin thank you you too we got the iced coffee yeah. now hopefully they don't fall but you know yeah okay so Y'all seen when I showed y'all how the snow look. Look at it now. It's it's getting there, y'all. It's getting yeah. there. So I just got back home and I told y'all I had a list of things to do. So now that I'm home, I can finally um see everything I have to do. So I have a busy day ahead of me. So first what I need to do is um clean up my room so that um I can have some space to work with everything I need to do. Um, I'm going to be including the Love Me hair wig review in this video. So I need to do that. And then I have a client wig that I need to style. I already washed it. I just need to style it. And then I need to dye my vacation hair and style that. And then I may pack a little. I may not do too much packing today because I just have so much to do. It is, what time is it? 
it's about to be two o'clock so yeah i'm gonna try to straighten up and then i'm just gonna dive right into the love me hair review so y'all stay tuned for that i'll be back once it's time if y'all can see my braid mind y'all business <laughs> mind y'all business okay because i just threw this wig on because i have to go to the store but yes it's definitely snowing outside so y'all be careful out there in the snow but yeah let's go ahead and um clean up this room a little bit and then i'll see y'all when it's time to do the review okay girl drinking my coffee from duncan I just got a glob of sugar that just came up the straw. Mm. Okay. Reviewing Love Me Hair. I just love their packaging. They did not do this. This was the post office people. They messing up the package in the post office. But I just love this. This is so cute. All of the details about this wig will, y'all know, it's going to be in the description box. So make sure you check there. For all the important information and yeah let's just get to unboxing this and see what it's given enjoy your hair journey from now on helena the founder of love me so shout out to her because she has some bomb hair bomb packaging all that do get your unit in this cute satin bag is this satin You get your hair in this cute bag and it says their name, Love Me. And then, of course, you know, they're going to hook you up with the goodies. So, we got some goodies in here. It came with a comb. I already used it. Sorry. I got two of these, y'all. Two of these combs are amazing for combing your wigs. And they are good for using on your natural hair. And then you have this in here to part your hair. Love it. Some details on how to care for your hair um, if you need to return and re refund the wig for any reason all of that information is here of course y'all know they blessed us with the lashes so I got me some lashes I got some press on nails cute 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 scrunchy I have this and I also have one of these already can y'all please comment below and tell me what is this for? I don't know if I'm slow. Like, what do I use this for? Is this a hairpin? Or what is this? It comes with a net around it to protect the hair. The 5x5 five five wet and wavy undetectable invisible lace glueless closure wig. Y'all know I'm going to talk about the undetectable lace. So if you've seen my previous video... Um, with love me here y'all seen how I showed y'all the difference between their undetectable lace and then regular lace I'll put that clip right here <sighs> y'all do y'all see how it just melts into the skin so let's actually get into this 5x5 five five closure so again this is their undetectable lace so undetectable and as you can see the knots are very small um you kind of you have a, a pre-plugged hairline so I, I believe that Love Me Hair is very beginner friendly for those people who don't really know how to do their own hair. Start with Love Me. Get Love Me because you won't be disappointed and it's an easy process to just cut the lace and put the wig on. So again, this is a 5x5. Five five. So this is how much space that you get to work with. And this is, this is a lot of space. So you could do a middle part, side part. You have a lot of room to do whatever you want to do, honestly. And adjustable band on the inside so that your wig won't come off and the good thing about this is you can wear your wig glueless yes you heard me right glueless so you don't have to put all that gunk on your hair you could just melt it down use your elastic bands um as far as the combs you are provided with four combs so you have two on the side one in the back and then one right in the middle here so four combs total and then if you still need some extra support they do give you these adjustable straps in the back that you can connect let's talk about these curls though so beautiful so pretty so pretty look at these curls like and then once you wet it they're just gonna pop 
even more so the hair is definitely thick look at that thick and your hand will run directly through this unit no tangles no snags it's really soft and really full at the ends I love that because you know, I hate a thin curly wig like y'all see how y'all can't see my hand through the unit that right there is a sign to get this wet and wavy unit 20 inches 180 density 100% human hair from one donor one donor one um, it comes in a natural black color and the hairline like I said it is pre-plugged and you can you can dye this hair it's adjustable their circumference is about 22.5 inches so that's standard medium um, the lace is top Swiss lace and then again it is five by five so I just want y'all to get into this lace again how it just disappears on my hand you don't even see the lace you know why you can't see the lace because it's undetectable boo undetectable so so one thing that y'all need to know about me is I have a big head so the wig is fitting very good and as you can see you do not see the lace at all and I, I have not cut any lace and you can't see it this is amazing like here's the lace here's my against my skin undetectable 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 so you wouldn't even know that I didn't cut the lace yet you wouldn't know you wouldn't know so the hair is so soft and like I said Drew you have so much space to work with so you can do you a middle part you can do side part I still don't know what kind of part I want to do yet it's most likely given side part because I never did a side part with a 5x5 five five, so let me show y'all how long the hair is on me comes like right underneath my boob and you can see it's very full and flowy and again my hand is going directly through so yeah 20 inches is coming to like my bra strap or my mid back okay y'all so i'm just gonna let the bleach sit on there for about 20 to 25 minutes or whenever the knots start to change i'm back and i did go ahead and bleach the knots and i plucked it a little bit more so let me show y'all that so like i said i am going to do a side part with this wig and right now the hair is fluffy because I combed it out so it's actually cute like this too <laughs> okay so let's um define my part and then we'll start hot combing and also by the way the lace is still on because I want to make sure I style before I cut any lace <laughs> So I'm going to take this um, wig off, put it on my mannequin head, and try to get it a little bit more, you know, styled up and stuff. Okay, y'all, so I put a little bit of makeup in the part so I didn't have to pluck it. So let me just give y'all a close-up of what it's looking like now. The lace is still not cut, as y'all can see. I'm just going to let y'all see. So when cutting the lace, this is what I like to do y'all. I like to start off with the little tab pieces first. So this, I like to cut those off. So let's cut this one off as well. You can go in and cut your lace off. And it's just crazy to me because you still can't even see it like you won't even know that the lace is still on 
<laughs> Y'all. So, excuse that I burnt myself with a hot comb, but you see that? Absolutely no glue. This is the hair completely brushed out. Let me stand up so y'all can see. So this is the hair brushed out. Look how full this is. It's so pretty. Let me show y'all the back. So we'll just part out a thin piece. Okay, so now that I got my baby hair in place, I'm just gonna tie that down just so it can stay. Okay guys, I am backity backity back and as you can see I took the band off and this is what the hairline is giving. This is again a 5x5 five five closure, glueless, wet and wavy. So I am going to define the curls for y'all on camera but I just wanted to show you the hair like brushed out. It is so pretty, so pretty. So pretty, so pretty. So we're gonna go ahead and um, wet these curls. The things that you're gonna need to get your curls nice and poppin' and juicy is some water and conditioner. So I'm gonna put a little bit of my conditioner in here and shake it up. I feel like a scientist. I ain't got that much conditioner, y'all. Hey, Okay y'all, so this is the wig, completely glueless, like I can literally slide a comb underneath this right now. See that? Completely glueless. Um, yeah, so wet and wavy, check them out. Use my code Karen20. My water and conditioner mixture. Spread, ooh, it went in my eye y'all, it went in my eye. Just gonna spritz it a little and then take my comb and comb it through. Look at these curls. They bouncing right back. And you can also just use your hand. You don't even need to use a um, comb. But you do want to just get your hair nice and wet like this. Make sure you get the bottom too. Okay, so now y'all can see this is the wet side undetectable boo <laughs> y'all so i beat the snow y'all remember i showed y'all earlier when um i showed y'all a little earlier when it was starting to snow y'all yeah, see this is ridiculous the chairs fell <laughs> well yes it is snowing but the Love Me hair review was a success. I'll get to see like how the hair is changing throughout the video. So right now it's wet and stuff. So we're just going to do other stuff and let this dry down. And I should be back on camera once the hair is dry. But this is it now. Um, I told y'all I had to clean my room. I'm not even going to show y'all my room. You could probably see a little sneak peek back there. But... I have to clean my room. I have a client wig to wand curl and the packing stuff is gonna be tomorrow or whatever. Um, I just finished cleaning up. I'm not completely done cleaning up, but I straightened up enough to be able to, you know, do other work and stuff. So I did um, let my hair air dry. As y'all can see, 
these curls are beautiful there we go looks better so now y'all can see the curls a lot better look how fluffy the curls are y'all fluffy bouncy they're not stiff and I only use conditioner and water so this is bomb it's actually about to be 7 30 and i'm supposed to be working out with my sis so we about to pull up this workout video on youtube and do this workout on facetime together it's a 20 minute workout so once i get done doing that i am then going to start my client wig which she wants some wine curls i may record me doing a little bit my camera is slightly about to die but i'll be able to get a little bit of footage um yeah do i want to put on some gym shoes okay y'all so we are about to do this workout i have youtube pulled up i'll show y'all the workout we're doing but um i got on this little waist wrap if y'all seen my instagram y'all definitely seen this go ahead and link the where i got it from on the screen yeah we're gonna be on facetime so let's see I just text her and said, okay, I am ready. This is the workout video that we're gonna be doing. I'm gonna be able to show y'all no workout footage. I'm sorry. Okay, y'all, so <laughs> obviously I then worked out and I've been sitting around the house. I actually took my wig off. I just threw it back on um, just to show y'all again. And I'll be wearing this to work and stuff. Um, What was I about to say? Oh, I finished my client wig. Right now, I just got the wig wrapped in a net. I'll go ahead and insert the curls um, on the screen. But she just wanted some wand curls. So, I got that protected in the net. So, that the curls can try to um, like stay as tight as possible until she's ready for them to drop. So, I'm also bleaching the knots on my wig for my vacation. So, that's doing that. I'm going to let that sit for about... 15 so 20 minutes yeah i'm actually gonna take this wig off and put a bonnet on because i'm about to get ready for bed not too much else is going on for the rest of the night the workout was really 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 fun so we're gonna be doing that pretty often and i'll put the link for that in the description box so if y'all wanna get into the little home videos shout out to my cousin vivi because she acts she actually um sent me the link to those videos so shout out to her but i'm gonna put those in the description box get up get the moving dancing it is so much fun i was tired 20 minute exercise but it was fun tomorrow i gotta go get my feet done in the morning before work and i have to go to the bank to deposit some money so y'all will see me in the morning toodaloo my booze <laughs> hey everyone it is friday february 18th let me make sure yes it's five ugh, 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 i'm reading messages <laughs> february the 18th which is friday and it is currently 10 3 about to get ready and go to the nail shop to get my feet done so i'm i got my car started because it's pretty cold out and i'm pretty sure i got a shovel the sidewalk before I leave because how we gonna get out you know three o'clock I gotta go to work so you won't be saying too much in my face today but I just wanted to say good morning I'm trying to debate if I want to get my eyebrows done as well because for you all who don't know I have psoriasis so I get like these crazy flare-ups um they're random they just happen out of nowhere notice like if i'm anxious or my anxiety is you know 
that's when my flare-ups start to happen i don't know y'all i'm just anxious for this trip <laughs> so my skin is just responding to how i feel probably well y'all can see it you see how it's like inflamed and red and stuff that is my psoriasis acting up so yeah i hate it because sometimes it does burn um when i go out in this cold weather it is that oil is just gonna the psoriasis is gonna eat up the oil and it's gonna be like a dry flake on my face i'm a picker so i picked the skin well let me stop rambling so much but yeah i'm just i don't feel like going outside in the cold but i got to <laughs> clearly i did not vlog when i was at the bank but i did go to the bank i'm done at the nail shop um uh, my toes they're not cute i ain't even gonna cap to y'all they they're not cute i'm not happy about my toes at all but i didn't feel like well i couldn't really i mean i could have complained they passable but it's just not she could have did better they be blowing me because they charge all this money for their services and then do a poor job like let me show y'all i mean my feet not they not ugly but they just not what i'm used that one is fat so i am about to just chill my client finna come get her wig and I will see y'all once I get home tonight because just got home from work literally like maybe 10 minutes ago. It is 11.32 y'all and I'm eating. This is my first meal for the day. I had, nope, I had Dunkin' Donuts earlier. I got some chilies. I got some chicken alfredo and I already ate half of it and I'm pretty full. So I'm done with that. I got some of their loaded mashed potatoes and then I got a baked potato soup in the refrigerator. So all of this is going to get ate tomorrow before work. So the good thing is I got lunch for tomorrow. That's my phone if y'all. It's the nail shop in the morning. So now, um, so I died my wig i don't know if i showed y'all in some previous clips but if i did y'all know i dyed my vacation wig jet black so last night when i rinsed it out um i couldn't tell because you know when the hair is wet it's gonna appear darker anyways so um when the hair over dry i mean <laughs> when the hair air dried i was able to see the color payout a little bit better it was natural brown so the color did not take i did the watercolor method and i dyed the front tool with actual box box dye but the color did not take so um what i did was go back with my rinse and just apply it you know wherever it can go and right now it does look jet black what else do i need to do y'all enough my bed and then this is y'all probably like what the heck girl so this is just stuff from Shein, um my toiletry bag my suitcase all of this stuff is over here i have not packed all of my clothes is in a suitcase but it's not like packed down properly so i'm gonna try to get that done tonight but it's really just like the two important things that i need to get done is shave my legs and arms i mean yeah shave my legs and arms and then take care of this wig i want to start packing with y'all but i don't know so i'll be back once i um at least get out the shower and once this hair is rinsed out and stuff okay guys so i just officially finished in the shower the process was super long but i am smooth like a baby's bottom i did see on my arm it's a few hairs so i'm gonna go back and get those tomorrow when i get in the shower it's not a lot i guess i ain't leave the stuff on long enough i didn't use near have y'all ever used um magic shave i'll put a picture of what it is right there um yeah i tried that because y'all know near be burning people so 
Um, I've been using Magic Shave for a while now. And it's really freaking good. I highly recommend. I don't know. I'm tired. And with that wig right there. The one that I told y'all I was dying. I mean rinsing Jet Black. I'm going to let that sit on overnight and rinse that out in the morning. So yeah, let's let me just show y'all some stuff that I'll be packing. Okay, y'all. So this I feel is super essential. I freaking love this. Like this is a must have. So I got like this travel caddy or whatever you want to call it um it has one two three four compartments and then like a brush bag let me get that it comes with this bag as well so and here i just got like some jewelry razors just in case i need to shave um some perfumes lip balms alcohol wipes my lace glue this is all of my toiletries body wash all that good stuff this is makeup and then this is like just little knickknacks panty liners um makeup remover wipes primers scissors and then in here is going to be my makeup brushes so okay, so y'all remember i told y'all i was packed but i wasn't really packed so let me show y'all yikes okay so this side is going to be my shoes and my purses. I got shoes in here too. And then this side is going to be where my clothes will go. So everything is kind of just thrown in there. I will see y'all tomorrow at the nail shop. So stay tuned and see y'all later. Good night. Good morning, everyone. So I'm on my way to the nail shop. Just wanted to say good morning, show my face. I will see y'all once I get there. Oh, round your boy, you act so tough Like you've never been in love If you don't quit acting up Alone is where you're going in love Oh, brother, you may think that I'm crazy You should ask her out about me Put your trust in me, baby Okay, y'all, so y'all see that I did not finish the video. So this is the end result of the nails. Um, I'm going to actually put that picture that I showed y'all on the screen here. Now, I do like my nails. Don't get me wrong, but there are some imperfections. So when she first did it, um, I did not like the French tip because it was like super thick. So I told her... Um, but okay y'all so i didn't say anything because i thought she was going to be able to go back in with the um nail polish remover or acetone to like shape it more to define the shape my price did end up going up to 75 which i don't feel is fair because i um when i come in the nail shop i always show them a reference picture we spend our hard earned money for luxury services and they kind of just do what they want to do so yeah y'all this is my experience y'all know that i always 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 go to that nail shop i loved when they did my nails and i still like the results but you know there are some are some imperfections that have that could have been simply corrected i will not be paying 70 up for nails ever again so that was my last time y'all i promise you if if i have to rock press on from now on that's what it's gonna be but these nails, whoo, y'all, I ain't even gonna lie. I shed a 10 in the car because I can't believe I just paid $75 for nails. Like, at least they could have been extendo nails or something. I'm just sick. But if you love me, cash out me $75. <laughs> it's dark, y'all, but what's today? Today is Sunday. February 20th.
Got off at 8. So right now it's 8.46 and I'm on my way to Walmart because we need to get a little, little something. So that's what we about to do. I'm with D. Y'all can't see because the light is so dark. But yeah, so it's the day before our trip and we're just kind of finishing up getting some little knickknacks. Where these people seen Walmart before? 